Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Don't Starve. Let's continue our adventures as WX78. Uh, at least I believe that's his name. Uh, at the time of this rec recording... Oh shit, son. Oh shit, sure, I thought that was a fuck. <laughs> Woo! I thought for a second night was about to hit. Um, but at the time of this recording, the other episode has yet to go live. The goddamn YouTube has been a bitch the past few days and has not been doing or uploading at prompt times at all. So I apologize... Um, I apologize ahead of time that we are, uh, that I'm not able to respond to whatever comments you may or may not be leaving. But, everything should be fine overall, uh, and I look forward to continuing. So, I still don't know what the hell that giant tree thing was. I'm curious if he was a giant, if that was one of the giants. I know there's a few, I don't know what ones there are and what they look like, but he looked like a giant, so I'm gonna go ahead and say maybe, maybe he was a giant? I don't know, we'll see. We are not really getting all that hurt. Uh, luckily, the, the hat has been doing us a good job at keeping us uh, dry, so I don't have to worry about that too much. We do want to make one plank, just so I have something to keep the fire going all night long. And we want to keep an eye out and see what we want to focus on making next, outside of just typical exploration stuff. Uh, we also want to go kill a lot of spiders, I think. Spiders are going to be good. Um, honey poultice... Compass, there's a lot of stuff over here. We need to make a ah, goddamn backpack, actually, now that I think about it. Do I have the twigs? I don't. So we're going to make a backpack next. Um, do we have a shovel? I know I made one. I do want to dig up a couple things. Just to kind of get these. Nah, fuck, fuck. I knew it. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. I was really hoping that that wasn't going to really stir them. I can't go too far. Uh, let's go ahead and start the fire up. Get out of here. Okay, 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 okay! God damn it! Yeah, be gone, foul beasts! Can you just leave me alone? Uh -huh. You know, attack Chester so I can kick your ass again. How's that sound? Yeah, F you. <laughs> yeah. I can take a lot of I can take a lot of punishment though because I have a lot of extra health. Leave it alone. And I have um a lot of gears too to heal myself with. I actually can just kinda Yeah. Oh, get your ass over here. Die, son of a bitch. Mm-mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Hell no. Get out. Die. Woo! We, uh, we can take a hell of a lot of a beating, actually, which is pretty awesome. Wait, 254 life? Yeah, we're looking really, really good. I like it. I like that he can uh, kind of upgrade his health with that. Uh, I'm curious if he upgrades anything else, though. I'd, I'd like it if he did. We can always use these stingers for traps and stuff later. Still no idea what to do with the living log yet. I'm hoping something cool will come of it. I just want the daytime to be over. I'm glad Chester didn't end up dying. Let's go ahead and grab this. Let's start cooking up some seeds. Can I cook honey? I wonder. No. So I'll put it away for now. And I'm sure honey does rot eventually and become useless. Are we full? I don't think we're quite full, but we're getting there. Uh, Chester here, have some gears, pal. This is going to be for later. I'll enjoy those at another time when, uh, at my leisure. Nighttime is almost over, then we can go get some twigs, we can get a backpack up and running. Uh, I'm pretty sure backpack doesn't take much. Yeah, just we need three more twigs we can make a backpack. That's going to be really, really helpful. Daytime has arrived. Let's uh, do some cleaning up of the area as well. What is happening over here? Why is this bee just chilling over here? See you later. So what is over here, I wonder? So this is... I could put, like, you guys said I could collect a bunch of stuff and I can, like, put it all in there. More dead things? Okay, sorry. A un one unit of bee storage. I bet you I could make, like, a hive. I'm pretty sure I can make a hive anyway. This rain has been going on for days. This is those mole things. Right? Home of a small digger. Thank you, sir, for that obvious ad uh, advice. Let's continue collecting things. The huge. Hmm. Don't bother me, and I won't bother you. You're an asshole. 
You're a dick. I'm just gonna kill you and your whole family. I didn't want to collect that evil flower thing. Come here. I have to click on you like a million times to even hit you. I wish I could plant this. Die. Wait, what? And why do you have... Why are you in the like a normal nest over there? F off! You all suck. You all suck so many balls. Like, more balls than usual. If there was a scale of one to balls, you guys are like a balls. Yeah, F, F you guys. He's like your distant cousin. He doesn't belong to your effing hive. Get away from me! What the hell? You guys are some of the most persistent motherfuckers I've ever met. Get! Be gone! Hey, god damn. You're a fucking bee, man. You shouldn't be out in the rain. I'm gonna get rid of your hives so fast. One day, they'll all be dead. And you're gonna regret messing with me. You truly are. Alright. So let's go make a backpack, now that we're not dying. I like our science machine, by the way. I'm just only realizing it was like a tree trunk with like a rope and some spinny wheels. Alright. Got a backpack now. Excellent. Anything else I need to make? Hmm. Cinello vision, huh? Actually, you know what we need is we need like a bug net so we can capture some stuff. Luxury axe and all that stuff's nice, but... Actually, we're gonna get a pitchfork too. Getting a pitchfork is useful. Don't need a razor. I don't grow a beard. Um... Manure would be really good too. Papyrus doesn't really do me anything. Do I have gold on me? I only have three gold left. That's it? Damn, I thought I had more than that. Chester, here. Eat up. We need more gold. Yeah, of course there's like a million of you assholes. I really just want to get rid of your stupid hive. I don't know if I can, but I'm gonna friggin' try. I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying! Ah! Fuck off. You assholes. I hate you all. You son of a bitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, oh, God! Oh, good lord! Alright, shit! Not, not Chester. Anything but Chester. Alright, I gotta eat some gears, I guess. Ah, oh, what a waste of gears. What a... What assholes. I guess it's just the, the that side of the map is just gonna be off limits to me for a little while. Not much over there. It's like literally a field of evil bastards. And it's already getting dark out. God damn it. Aw, oh, you shit in my hole right now. Get out. Get. Get. Leave poor Chester alone. Get him. Get. He has my shit in him. Where the hell is he? Come here, Chester. Come on, buddy. I'm gonna put you there. Somewhere I can actually fucking watch you. God damn it, man. Holy crap. Are you serious? Get out of here! You would think that they don't infinitely friggin' spawn, but apparently they do. I'm, in this, I'm living in a danger zone. This is not good. That, did that hurt me? I don't know what that actually did. I wanted to see if that would hurt me. It doesn't look like it hurt me. Also, it does not seem like it helped me. So we can dig this up, I think. I think I can use this as, like, fuel. Cool. Alright, I can. So I can dig up a turf and use it as fuel. That's useful. It doesn't really do much as far as fuel is concerned, though. But when I build walls and stuff, we'll actually end up doing that. I'm glad I moved Chester a little bit, though. Get him a little bit further away from those trees so I can actually see where I'm, what I'm doing when I'm trying to save him. Not let the bees absolutely rape him. Okay. Let's go... Uh, I guess that's the way we're going to want to go. Do I have enough for torch? Yes, I do. So I could do some exploration. Might want to. 
getting late though. Hmm. Well, let's get a torch built. And let's do a little bit of looking around. Alright, let's head back. Fuck it. Not worth risking it. Oh, now we can't see anything. Okay. Back up this way. Light that on fire if I hate my life. Uh, what do we want to fuel this with? I guess just regular logs. Eat up, Chester. It'd be, it would be hilarious if, like, you put, like, a torch in Chester to store it, and he has just smoke that billows from his mouth at all times. That would be great. Let's chop down some of these trees. Clear out this area. Hopefully none of these trees come to life. If that tree, by the way, was a giant, he was kind of a pushover for a giant. His attacks were slow, predictable, and I was able to avoid them. I kind of got him stuck up on, like, the bees, who actually did most of the work. A little bit disappointing, though I'm sure there's a bunch of other different kinds of giants along the way. Grab all this. We'll chop. We'll, we'll dig up the, uh... That's a little bit weird. That little arrow is jumping. We'll dig up all these stumps later. Just want to get some of these logs done. And we'll use them to fuel the fire. And we'll get this. There we go. Dig all this up. We're going to be working on getting some golden tools up soon enough. We don't really have the gold to spare yet. I need to come across some graveyards. I need to come across the pig king, really. That's going to make sure that we have a pretty good supply of gold. Alright. Let's just keep chopping these areas out. I think clearing out these trees over here is going to be useful. We have a lot of forest over here, and it's not really doing anything useful for us other than kind of blocking our walking path. And I'm out of an uh, axe, so let's make another. Good day to everybody. Here we go. I have that attack music going on, which worries me. Let's go ahead and pop this. Alright, let's head back and keep exploring where we were exploring before. Heading down in that general direction. So like this. This away, this away. One, two, one, two. Hop, hop, pip, pip, cheerio and all that. Sorry, I just really want to be English. Hanging out with Dean all the time just makes me want to be like him. He's such a wonderful human being. just want to marry Dean. I want to have Dean's babies. Just kidding. Ew, Dean babies. They'd be tall monstrosities. Reign of Giants. It's the name of the sequel after uh, they make Reign of Dean. All his babies would just be giants. That's a terrible joke. This is why I don't do funny things. I'm not a funny dude. What? Alright, let's do it. Do you believe in magic? What the hell am I supposed to do with this? Hey! Oh well. Whatever. So I activated this touchstone. I don't know what the hell that's about. Honestly, don't know, don't know if I care enough. Gold! There be gold in them there hills! Yuck, yuck! Sorry. I'm just, I'm a fucking wreck today. I don't know what's wrong with me! Uh, another axe? A shore, another pickaxe, rather. Shall we start digging up graves? I feel like we shall. Don't piss me. Ah, yeah, gears. Lots of gears. Why are they burying gears here? Eh, ah, fucking red bees. I don't want to bring my sanity too far down, though. I'm sure it's powered up enough where I don't have to worry about it. Ah, oh, shit. A Maxwell statue. High levels of evil detected. I do have a pickaxe. I actually have a bunch. Alright, well, we'll just keep on pickaxing that shit. Yeah, eat it, Maxwell. This is stone? Oh, it leads to the underground. Oh, right. I have actually not gone in the underground. Can we just go down there and then... Let's take a look. 
<laughs> Thanks, Marlton Johnson. Let's see what's underground. I assume we can leave whenever we want. Spiders and bats, oh my. Ah, yeah, we can. It's raining underground, too. Guano, and it's dark as hell. Uh, I'm ready to leave. I don't think I can actually do anything. Ha! It died. Classic human error. And it's like raining under here. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Another time, perhaps. We know where it is. It's marked on our mini-map now, so... I'm just ready for this rain to be done. Is that the birch tree evil monsters? Is that what I saw over there? Ah, frogs. We have bat poop, though. That'll be useful. Nope, that was just frogs. It's actually pouring right now. Whoa, is it actually... Wait a minute, is it raining frogs right now? What the hell? Is this because I broke the Maxwell statue? I'm sorry. I shouldn't have done that. My mistake. Please don't hate me. I just wanna I just wanna live life and explore. Whoa! Am I healed? I'm moving a lot faster. Ow, ow, ow! Fuck! Good thing I got overcharged and healed up. Yeah, night is approaching. What the hell? Man, this is like the weirdest playthrough of this game I've ever had in my entire life. I have no idea what's going on. I have no idea why. I do believe in magic, sir. Uh, where is my camp? Over this way. I love that I'm overcharged. That was cool to see that uh, he gets struck by lightning. Finally happened. It healed me too, which is like just... I mean, you can't really rely on that to do a lot of your healing, but it was lucky. I think I'm giving off light, too. I am giving off light. I wonder how long that lasts. But I'm home. Before the night time takes over. I would love to kick these bees' asses, but... I don't have a head module. Have I not gone up here yet? I think I actually have, yeah. What the fuck? Ah! Ah! Is this what happened to them all? Ah! Is this what happened to the bees, guys? What the hell? This game is... This game is so different! It's so fucking weird! I don't understand what's going on anymore. Soggy green cap. Yeah, because everything's been raining for, like, years. Seriously. It's still going. It's still, like... Insanely overcharged, for whatever reason. Um, let's just pop this fire, I guess. Good thing it's contained. Oh, everybody says that. He even says in the lower cases, which is a little depressing. So we're almost hitting a full moon, which is cool, because then we can explore at night. But for now, we'll have to stay here. Alright, we'll wrap this episode up here. I don't know what the hell's going on. It's cool, there's no doubt. I just, I am so confused. I'm excited to see what the comments are going to be. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you're enjoying it, dropping a like is the best way to show your support, as well as coming back tomorrow for some more Don't Starve. And as always... I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.